Welcome back to another video of where we have an insane start here on TCG Card Simulator. I want to show you guys here, we're going to reach level 10 right now, but I'm also using a speed mod uh, to open up the packs. Uh, it's actually pretty nice. I, I'm actually going to use this on my Let's Play as well, uh, because we can get more stuff done. And you can set the value, like how high has it, does it have to be before you um, before it stops. Now, I just want to see over here. Our highest card value we found, like, all the time was $121. Not that high, to be honest. And I don't think we found any ghost cards. No, we didn't. Or any destiny cards. So, yeah, our highest value, 121, 115. Uh, it's not that bad, actually. But you can see how much remained. I bought $1,000 worth. Um, we'll eventually maybe open up this depending on how long or how many days we do of this playthrough. Um, but right now we can actually get a Zachary in our team. So we're going to do just that. We're going to go down to uh, go recruit. I'm going to hire Zachary and Zachary is going to be our guy behind the counter and we will be doing the rest. Uh, we will be doing um, the rest over here. So we're going to move these boxes a little bit across so we can buy a third shelf. So buy um, my DIY, buy another shelf. We're going to have our third one over here. And we're just going to keep on keeping on with this strategy until our eyes bleed, pretty much. <laughs> so getting them stacked is not a big deal, but I just want to get them out of the street for when we purchase a uh, more that is not going to be a problem for us. Uh, we also, now that I see that guy, we also need to buy the license for spray because Zachary might be a slow uh, behind the counter. We just got him here. So a man counter for me. Thank you. So that is done. So we have a few people here. So we'll open shop. There we go. We didn't buy anything. We can actually keep this one for now. Unhappy? Some of these dudes are not happy. Zachary, why are you so slow? I think she's also not doing it. So, 62. I thought it would be faster with uh, Zachary with us, but... No evidence of that so far. Okay, so we can just do this. And we have another full box. Okay, so this is working fine so far. He's also not buying. All shelf is stacked. Hmm. 
Another guy not buying. Take out of my hand quickly. Goodness. Okay, Zachary, let me help you there. Come back, Zachary. Come back anytime. Yeah, never mind, Zachary. You suck. You suck. You're supposed to help me. We can do this. Bro, he has one out of nine chance. Oh. Okay, she's not buying. Zachary, please, bro. Please, Zachary. Don't make me fire you on day one, dude. Okay, so what we can do is we can take over the counter. Since we have still enough cards, that's doing okay. We chose the same shelf twice. Let's buy more. We chose from the same shelf again. So pretty unlucky when stuff like this happens. Oh, she's not buying. Want to get these clients out of your shop? Okay, that's fine. 
Uh, we want to buy a spray before it becomes an issue. Come on, I clicked on cart three times. He's not buying. Oh man, I have my spray here. Luckily, this guy didn't buy. Buy some stuff. So we hope now that that guy didn't roll the same shelf and it was empty. Because then it would suck. He's not buying. Okay, that worked. Goodness, looking through someone's mouth. Only bought one. Oh, what am I doing? I'm slower than Zachary, bro. What the heck? Mana counter a bit. 124. Fourteen. Someone else coming in. Only buying one. Ninety-three. She's not buying. Stinky is. Not buying. Oh, he is. Mm. 
Yeah, work, keep it real. There we go. Uh, 62. And that's another day done. This was a little bit more stressful, dude. This day was definitely more stressful. It felt like I had to do more, even though I, I had help. Okay, there we go. Just manning up some, uh, some boxes. Yeah, we had to do so much more today um, in order to make this work. Uh, we're going to buy another extension here. Because extensions mean we're going to get more clients. Uh, we're also going to buy... Let's buy uh, three more racks. So three more, three more racks. And uh, we can just buy $3,000 worth. Let's just see here. That's as close to it as we can get. <laughs> Dude, we're just making bank, bro. That's all we're here for. Um, the more racks you have, the more likely they are not to choose the same rack, obviously. Um, so, it's just going to be better overall. Hello. There we go. This one's full now. But I think you guys you guys get the gist of how this works. Um to get the most insane start. Because soon we'll be able to buy the next box, and it's just gonna rinse and repeat. Um, at that point, it might be better to rather get two restockers, uh, because at the end of the day, you want your whole like a whole place to be just these things, um, and it will just be working out pretty good. Yeah, Zachary, spray people in the eye when they are. Not obeying the rules, okay? When they're stinky, refuse to shower. Uh, let me just see over here. Um, so we almost reached level 11 in one day. I just want to see over here. Uh, so we can buy the next box. Uh, which is obviously... Well, it's, it's hard to say if it's more profitable. Um, it really depends on the day. But normally the higher you go, the more profitable it, it is. Um... For me, it's just easier to do this box uh, because we can we contain eight of these boxes inside. Um, for this, I, I think it will be better to do it at level 12. So you can either open up packages until 12 uh, and then also have half your racks with this, but it will become confusing. Um, it's just going to be better to have more racks overall. Um, because the chance they're gonna once they come into the store, store, they're gonna roll which one to go for, and they have so many options already here. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six racks. Uh, uh, all six have three, um, or yeah, they have three shelves. So that it will be uh, eight, one of eighteen that they have to roll. So the chance of them going for the same one starts to become almost nothing. And then, at the end of the day, you'll, you'll just have two people racking the whole time, and that could be enough to uh, just make this super sustainable over time. Especially if you put the boxes close by, uh, because if people buy, they'll just uh, walk until here uh, with this new update, so it's really, really cool. Obviously, the big boxes also will help these guys to re-rack. And the next employee we can get as is at, at level 15. 
So yeah, I could just open up boxes for five levels, but that's gonna be half an hour of uh, of cards that we most probably won't use ever again. Um, but you can see the point, like how to have the most income ever. Actually, we should just press enter here so we can actually see our day. So 22 dissatisfied customers. We actually made less money today um, than we did yesterday. So I don't know why that is. It might just be because RNG, you know. Um, it might also be that the price of the of each item went down. Uh, so th there's a lot of factors that will come and play here. Uh, what is the best to do? So also the employee cost me $500, which really sucks. But guys, that's going to be this video for today. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you did, please make sure to leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.